for a news anchor with 15 minutes to get ready. Let's go. First, plug in that curling wand, then dampen your beauty blender, and then grab your moisturizer or primer, and you're prepping your skin for that heavy TV makeup. I mix two foundations. One is a little more hydrating, and the other is the full coverage, high-definition TV makeup. We're dotting that all over our face because time is of the essence, and you're basically going to make sure that's as blended as you can possibly get it because viewers will notice if it's not. Then you're going to want to add your concealer to any problem spots and keep it bright underneath your eyes and on the bridge of your nose. Time for some cream contouring. For round faces like mine, you can do your cheekbones a little bit higher and then add your cream contour to your nose and your chin and if you want to, underneath your jawline as well and blend that out with your damp beauty blender and make sure not to get any of the dark contour into your light concealed spots. Set that with a loose powder and this is why we didn't get dressed first folks because it gets everywhere. Time for eyeshadow. You're going to take your neutral tone and you're going to put that all over the lid and in your crease. Then with a smaller brush, you're going to grab your darkest color and start building your outer corner. You are trying to make the number seven in your outer corner and into your crease. And you're going to run that along your bottom lashes as well to create that fox look that is so popular right now. You're going to use a smaller brush so you have a little bit more control with the darker color. You can always add more, but you can't necessarily take dark colors away. So you can start light and build that color up. Then with a clean fluffy brush, you're gonna buff out those edges so there aren't any harsh lines. Now we're ready for shimmer. Grab your lightest, most sparkly shade, put it on your finger and start bringing that into your inner corner and onto your lid. We want to draw more light into the inner corners of our eyes and leave the smoky darkness to the outer corners. It looks really nice on television. Again, we're going to be blending this out with a clean fluffy brush so you don't have a super harsh line between the dark and the light. Make sure it's seamless. Time for eyebrows. Brush through that eyebrow hair. Here I'm using the same dark eyeshadow we used on our outer corner because we are running out of time. It's almost show time. So I'm shaping those natural brows and being as precise as I can and not overdrawing them in any way. Time for your waterproof eyeliner so your makeup stays for the duration of your show. Do a little winged liner. Part two is going to be up and it'll feature contouring and false lashes. Stay tuned.